Hi everyone! Welcome back to my channel. If you're new, I'm Claudia and this is my Thursday Friday episode. Today I'm gonna be share with you my reviews and thoughts on these products. This is a Maybelline Fit Me Concealer and this is Holika Holika Cover and Hiding Liquid Concealer because I'm going to compare about American Best Concealer and Korean Best Concealer because in my opinion, this Korean product is really great and I've been using this for four years so it's like this one my everyday and go-to concealer because I have that really bad dark circle underneath my eye so I need concealer for my everyday use and this Maybelline Fit Me concealer I really wanted to try out this one because a lot of beauty vloggers and bloggers raving about this product so when I saw this in a beauty section in the drugstore I purchased this one. I don't know either this one is overrated and if you want to know if this is really deserving the praises it's getting or it's just an awesome brand gimmick and I'm going to give my review on this product as well. So without further ado, let's jump right in. Now I'm gonna be applying the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer in the side of my face which is your left side. I'm really impressed that it comes in this toe foot applicator. It's small and precise. I'm going to blend this with my finger. Then, I'm gonna be applying the Holika Holika Cover and Hiding Liquid Concealer in the side of my face, which is your right side. And I'm gonna be blending it with my finger. Well, I'm done applying these two concealers and to be fair, I'm not gonna set this with powder because we would like to see either it is creasing or not if we're not setting it with powder. Well, both sides are not creasing and blended well. And now, I will give my review and thoughts about this too. But before I share with you my review and thoughts, I'm going to finish up my makeup and I'll be back. Well, this too has almost the same consistency. It's really creamy, smooth, pigmented, and easy to apply. It's really blendable and just great for your everyday concealer. These two are not cakey or either plump or crease or sit like people know you're wearing a concealer. No, this appears like your skin but better. But I'm going to start with this one, the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer. And it's been one hour since I'm applying this product and I can say that this is easy to apply blends really well, also covers well and doesn't clump. This is a medium to full coverage and you can sheer it up or you want to build this up. And it's also elastic, so it's not like hard when you're trying to apply it. So that's good. Well, I used it on my under eye area and it goes on smoothly even though I didn't set it with powder. And this one little goes a long way so you don't really need to put too much like I did before if you just want it to be your everyday concealer. And this is really great for your under eye like your dark circle and also your blemishes and discoloration as well. And you can also use this as your eye primer. I mean you can use all concealers as an eye primer. This is perfect for your everyday concealer because it has a light texture that makes the application and blending very easily. And this is that soft matte finish, it's like sun finish. And this is also for all skin types, I think. And you just need some dots underneath your eye to get that your skin but better appearance. The shade range for the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer is impressive and neutral, with six options instead of three standards. I mean, if you have fair skin, you absolutely can use this and if you have deeper skin tone, you absolutely can use this as well. Well, I think this might be my go-to concealer since now on and I heard that this one is pretty long-lasting. Now time for the Hlika Hlika Cover and Hiding Liquid Concealer. Well, I have a hell long relationship with 
this concealer. I started use this when I was in college. I think when I was in my freshman year and I've been loving this for four years, I believe. So this is like my first ride or die concealer. This one can cover up your dark circle and doesn't grease even though you don't set it with powder because for my everyday use, I rarely set my concealer with powder. This one is a little bit thicker but if you're layering it like too much, it will get creasy and the coverage is just for fair and cool tone skin, I think because they just have two shades and mine is the darkest one this is O2 natural and the O1 is for porcelain skin like really fair skin you can't really work with this one if you have deeper skin tone so for you who have a deeper skin tone I really recommend this Maybelline Fit Me Concealer I also use this as my eyeshadow base in my previous makeup tutorial so I've been loving this and I will keep using this and when you're blending it with your finger it doesn't crease and sit on your skin nicely it's like your skin but better just like this one well I think this is my third tube the consistency of this one is almost the same with this one but this is a little bit thicker and this one a little goes a long way well if I was asked which one I'm going to repurchase I don't know well I love this too just the same and to give rate I'm going to rate this 9.5 out of 10 but just because I can give 10 out of 10 for a great product if I haven't tried another product and this one I'm going to rate this 9 out of 10 well for the best result you may need to set your concealer with powder you can use any translucent powder or loose powder or just a pressed powder and also don't ever forget to use the eye cream because eye cream is really necessary to moisturize your eye area and keep it hydrated you can use any eye cream that you like but I'm using the soap and glory rejuvenating eye cream I think that's all for my Thursday Friday episode today thank you so much for watching this video and don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe also leave comment and I'll see you on my next video bye girls